All right, folks, I am going to show you how to drain a water heater. This is very simple. Anybody can do it. Um, these things tend to drain slow. No, I, I do have a pump that will pull the water out of this really quick. I don't have it with me, and I need to drain this today. So let's get started. All right, so what you need is a hose. That's a hose out there. You need that hose to, uh, the end of the hose to be lower, that end of the hose to be lower than that drain spigot right there. So just remember that. All right, let's get our, let's get our hose here and put her on. Very, very simple. It's just like putting it onto a, you know, an outdoor spigot there. Same same deal, same setup. Get it good and tight because especially if your water heater's in the house, you don't want this thing dripping. Make sure you've got the washer in here in this hose. The hose washer. Get it good and snug, folks. Now, very simple. Look, sometimes you can just use a pair of pliers or a pair of channel locks on this. And then, but this one, see, it has, and most of them have this. It's just a turn. And that thing is opened up. That slot is going this way, which means it's open. That's closed. It's going this way. That's closed. Open. All right, so she's going to be draining slow until I open some things up. All right, so if your if your uh, water heater is old, if it's a newer one, a couple of years old, you can raise this. Did you hear that? That relief valve. Uh, this is this valve here. It's a, a P and T valve, so it's a pressure and temperature valve so if it gets too hot in here water will shoot out here if there's too much pressure build up in here water will shoot out here and so we opened it up and that way air is going to it's going to allow this to drain a whole lot faster all right folks we got a little water up here that happened the other day we uh, open this thing up to fill it. Anyway, it's a video for another day. Now, we are emptying this, so we've got the water shut off out at the road. And so what we're going to do is open this up just so it gets some good air. We got it getting air right here. And we're also going to make sure that we've got a spigot opened up. Now, this is an overkill, but we're going to make sure we've got a spigot opened up. And we do. I actually opened this up earlier. That's open. All right, and let's go in and let's open up something inside. We could do the sink, but it's so convenient just to do the washer box. So let's listen. We'll put the hot on. Did you hear it? Was making a little noise there. Now, once this thing starts emptying really good and gets low, the water level in the tank gets low, it is going to gurgle. Blah, bloop, blah, bloop, blah, bloop. All right, so we got everything opened up. Let's go check it out. Oh, looky there, folks. Huh. There we go. She's coming out good. Now, that is really good for a water heater to drain. Uh, that, that's a good flow for a water heater. Uh, so we're draining the water heater. the 
way back. Very simple, folks. Very, very simple. All right, so if you are going to flush out your water heater, I was going to make another video of flushing it out, but I think I'll just put that in this video. So if you were going to flush it out, you would do this. You would open this. Now, you would leave this closed. You would close this. You would leave it closed. You would never touch it. Listen, do not touch this valve if your water heater is old. You don't have to have this open. I would never do this to an old water heater, ever, ever. I would never touch this valve on an old water heater. You will end up having to replace it. It gets stuck open. It does. It'll get stuck open on an old water heater. And so if you've got an old water heater, bypass this. Don't touch it. Uh, if you're empty in your water heater, don't touch this. Open this and do everything else except opening this. Uh, so if you're going to flush your water heater, just real quick here, if you're going to flush out your water heater, which you need to do every so often, you hook up a hose just like we did. You open it up and you leave this on. Leave that on. You don't open this you leave it closed so leave this closed don't open up the spigot outside don't turn a faucet on inside don't open the valves on the washer box don't do any of that you just simply connect this here open it up and you let it roll this this will already be opened so you basically don't touch anything except this. Yeah, that's it. Maybe we'll do that in another video. So, But that is it. She's draining good, folks. That is how you drain a water heater. We'll see you.